go! February 11th? There it is. There it freaking is, dude. February 11th. Hell yes. That's freaking I'm awesome. I can't wait. That's at such a good time for it, too. There you have it, everyone. As you saw, the release date for Lost Ark was announced at the Video Game Awards. February 11th is the release date that we are working with for the game. Now, that is for the free-to-play version of the game. If you bought a Founders Pack at all, anywhere from the $14.99 pack up to the $99.99 pack, uh, it is beginning on February 8th with that three-day head start. So that would begin on a Tuesday, and the release would start on Friday for anybody who wants to just play the game completely free, never spend any money on it at all. So early February is when we're going to be getting this. Essentially, the very beginning of the second week of February is uh, the release of Lost Ark for those who have pre-ordered. So that's actually a really good release window for them. Uh, January was a little too close, it seems like, with what they wanted to do, especially with the sudden introduction of Sorceress. So now we're going to, you know, get this. We're in the home stretch now for Lost Ark. So it's it's a nice early part of February, which is good because February is packed with so many other games now. Uh, originally, people were just like, okay, there's Elden Ring. And that, that was it. I was like, okay, Elden Ring. Elden Ring. Now it's Elden Ring, Lost Ark. Guild Wars 2 expansion, Swodor expansion got pushed back to February, uh, Destiny 2 expansion, and now there's apparently a Crossfire <laughs> release as well. Like, there's all these things that are happening in February now for game releases, and so it's actually going to be a very packed month for game releases uh, and game expansion releases. So, really happy that they got it in the early part of February, so it's not uh, right there in the mix with everything else. Uh, it's a good one to two weeks before all the other uh, games that are planning to have their releases. So Lost Ark is getting in there first with it. So really looking forward to that. Um, but yeah, so, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm freaking excited. You guys should be excited too. Um, that being said, you know, as we said in the video, there is Sorceress is coming. It is replacing Summoner. This was a uh, last minute addition that they announced during December, uh, at the beginning of December, that we'd be getting Sorceress. And that actually, if you are looking for an opportunity to play it, because Sorceress was not available in any of our betas. So if you are looking forward to playing Sorceress and you want to play Sorceress, um, then beginning on December 22nd, Sorceress will actually be available on the Russian client. So definitely check out some videos on YouTube for how to access the Russian client. It's very straightforward and simple and easy. I'll put a link in the description to a video as well. Um, but it's it's really easy to get set up on the RU client. So if you are interested in checking out that class, because nobody's played it unless they've played on Korea, and it's now suddenly coming to our version, it's the newest class released in Lost Ark. Um, it will be on the Russian client uh, beginning December 22nd, and then it will be there from the beginning of the full release for NA and EU. Again, they they are replacing Summoner with Sorceress. So if you're looking to play Summoner, I'm sorry, it's not going to be there, but February 11th, guys, official full release. Head Start begins on February 8th. If you have not bought a Head Start pack or a Founders pack, whatever you want to call it, do so. This game's amazing. You are going to love it if you enjoy MMOs and good PvP and good PvE and a good story if you pay attention to it. But I know many of you will just, you know, spam G through it to get to max level as fast as possible. But that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy the content. You can find us live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Zav, and we'll be playing the only infighter that you will see in the game for the most part. Have a good one, and we'll catch you in the next one.